Okay, so I don't know much about this one, but again, I saw this during the Wholesome Games presentation. Um, and I think the only thing I know about it is that like you can put down like a bridge sticker to get across a river, for example. It's like kind of cute, kind of like, I don't know if it's per se choose your own adventure, but like, you know, you have solutions to puzzles via stickers. So I'm excited. Time has come, a new adventure awaits you. Remember that you can move some elements in sticker mode to advance. Uh, try to move those boxes. Okay, sticker mode. Oh. Aha. Uh -huh. Uh, okay, sticker mode off. Time has come, a new adventure awaits you. Uh, okay, I've already done that. Cool. I don't know why it's giving me vague vibes of Toem a little bit, which is like that picture game that we played really early on in the year. You can carry stickers with you by placing them on your sticker sheet. To open the sticker sheet, move the hand to the lower part of the screen. To close the sticker sheet, move the hand outside of the sheet. Oh my child, I'm glad you came. I hope you brought your old sticker album like I asked you to. It's very special in this place. Maybe because the sections are separated? Yeah, it might be. It's about careers of Lonesome Village, right? Sorry if you already said that. I don't even know what Lonesome Village is. I don't think I've even uh, heard of it, if I'm honest. I will surprise you. I'll go see you later. Uh, for now, go to the mountains. Love you from Dad. Okay. Don't know why there's like an outline here, but there is. Mm. I got a boat and I got some boxes and it looks like our way forward might be blocked by that. I can apparently move the letter. Okay, there's our sticker sheet. Reminds me of Carto, which is another cute game you should probably check out at some point. I need another one I don't think I've heard of. Can I steal the boxes too? I have a feeling I'm just gonna start like taking everything. I probably shouldn't. I probably don't need to. I'm gonna be like Mike in Tears of the Kingdom where he legit just steals everything that isn't nailed down. Can I like jump on my boat? Maybe? Hi, Sparks. How are you? Well, I can move trees, apparently. Okay. But I don't think I can get past that. Thank you, Itsu. I appreciate it. Do I have to... Are you a s- I just picked someone up and- okay. Yep. Can I take the crab with me too? Perfect, thank you. No, no, I want the crab. Give me the crab. Yeah, Andrew, I know you're hyped for that. How are you? How are you doing today? So now I gotta put her sticker here like that uh, plant uh, at the north is blocking the path. I've heard that crabs can get rid of that kind of plant. Try bringing the crab near that plant and see if the plant can be cleared. Maybe you can bring me with you for advice. Oh yes, I will. That's kind of interesting. All right, there we go. So I feel like this game might be just a tiny smidge quiet, so I'm just gonna turn that up a little bit. That's too loud now. Bear with. Sorry, this is one of those games where if you click out, the music stops. There we go. 
Are we all just saying Itsu now? Oh, I didn't mean to click on you again. I was trying to pick you up. What are you doing? That's not me. Uh. Oh, this is my favorite place to relax under the shade of the trees, but that raccoon took them. Could you help me plant five trees back here? Alright, well he took three, so I'm gonna have to go and grab some more, but... Bear with, I will get you more, friend. Oh my god, the blood of us isn't cute. I like that you can oh, I don't have that much room. Uh I like that you can like bring things from one area to another. That's very neat. Okay, I'm sorry, bear with. Bear with. Oh, no worries. Rebecca, I appreciate your lurk as always. Yeah, definitely most of them are going to be just like moving them around, like what works where. So the mysteries you have to force you across a meteorite to evolve it. <laughs> Thank you very much. Hey, could you return this tool to the other carp or to the carpenter? Thank you. You rewarded me with more stuff to do. I like fishes. Help me put five fishes in the pond, please. Just have to throw the rod on top of the object you want to move from the bottom. Wait, what? <laughs> Did I read that wrong? Probably. What platform are you playing on for today? Everything is on Steam. All of these are through the Steam Next Fest, but if you want to see... Um, where this game is going to be available... Um, you can do exclamation mark playing. It's a little bit tedious, like, in and out, in and out of the sticker sheet. Uh, I'll put this in here right now. There you go. Is that... her? No, maybe not. Reminds me of the star from Finding Nemo. Yeah, I was gonna say it too. I feel. I love the idea of this game, but it very much feels like this should be on like the DS, 3DS. Like it feels like a bottom screen, touch screen sort of thing almost. Um, like that's my initial feeling for it. There's a speech game that isn't set up to a- your mom has a vibrator. <laughs> yeah. Uh, an arrow is needed to play. I think I lost my arrow. Could you help me find it? Sure. I don't think I've seen it. <gasps> Blue, I did. Yes, that's our new um, our new YouTube series. It has Night in the Wood vibes. I'm almost getting a little Beacon Pines from it as well. Uh, and I enjoyed both of those. So, so far, it's been really good. 
that's been like my secret little project on the PS5 for a couple days now. My dream is to reconnect the island. I was working on a project that would accomplish this, but my saw disappeared. Only with a saw will I be able to finish my project. Well, I just so happen to have a saw. Yes. Okay, sir, you... Oh, there we go. It kind of sparkles when you're in the right place. Thank you for finding my Louis Sharp teeth. With it, I'll be able to finish my project. Oh, I got a bridge. Thank you. Okay, that's definitely going to be handy. Stealing your bridge. Okay, I will steal it when I need it. Never mind. Oh, apparently I'm going to need it soon. And I think that character is one that we're going to need to bring over to the water as well. What do you have to say about this? I'm assuming you're gonna be like, you need a bridge. Some time ago I met someone who had a book similar to yours full of stickers. Does your book also have an album? Uh, oh, so like you pick up. Wait, uh huh. So there's different things that you can pick up and you can kind of keep track of it. That's cool. That's cute, I like that. to the mountains. Oh, apparently I can't pick those up for whatever reason, but he could. Oh, here's my last fish, so I can put away this fishing rod. Oh, no, not up there. Oh, God. DLC pointer or the trailer was so disappointing that we recreated the CG trailer press release from February in, in engine. At least it's in engine though. If they had just showed the same thing again. And it was like, yeah, we've been working on it. It's like, have you? Oh, I'm so good at Stardew fishing. I don't know what you're on about. I love it. enough. Done a great job! Oh hey! I got a gold statue. Oh do you like thinking fishing? Can't stand fishing in Stardew. I know it's really hit or miss for some people. I get it. Okay so. I'm kind of nervous to put this down in case we lose it but I'm gonna put it right there and hope that I don't forget. It being fun. No, exactly. I'm talking about the same thing. I like it. I enjoy it. One lonely outpost yet. Yeah. No, I've heard about it, though. I've definitely heard about it. I think I've seen a trailer, maybe, but haven't probably looked at it. Raccoon came by and I told him about my dream of seeing the sunrise on the beach again. He gave me a peculiar sticker told me to put it on the shore. Could you help me get there? Yes, I can. I'm just gonna pick you right up, put you on my sticker sheet here. Exciting if it wasn't for the stuff you mentioned earlier. Yeah. Are you in a mood for Stardew? Not yet. Not yet, actually. I'm in a mood for a wonderful life. <laughs> That's gonna be it this summer. This is a magic moment. Look, here comes the sunrise. Is, is that a sticker? I can- can I steal the sun? Oh yes I can! I'm so sorry, lady. It's mine now. When does the sonic mood kick in? I don't know, random. It's your mood, not mine. It's all you. 
My sister hid near the mountain. If you help me find her and bring her back, I'll give you an arrow we took from the shooting gallery. I used to be able to break giant rocks, but now I can only break smaller rocks. The entrance to the mountains is blocked by rocks I could break. Yoink. And stolen. <laughs> I like this, just picking up people. That patch of map will be forever dark now. I guess it's cool because you can make some areas bright. Maybe? Mold, I can't see at night anymore. Break a few small rocks, but only in the daytime. Are you sticking? I am. Thankfully not to my chair. It's not that warm here yet. It's time to work. I must not perceive- Oh, Mandolin, I'm forewarning you. That's going to be all I'm on about for like the next month, probably, if not more. Can't play anywhere further. Get out of my way, intruder. Hey, Ren, how are you? Queen of size, of course. Welcome on in. Ah, oh, end of demo. Thanks for playing. That's cute. That's a really, really cute game. I like that. I like that. I'm sure there's probably other stuff we could do, but... Yeah, I think mobile or, like, tablet game would very much suit this. Um, again, let's take a look. Um, I don't think I could actually find any info about where this one was. I think I only could see it on Steam. Its website wasn't very uh, useful. You can see how little information I have on it. Um... It's an interesting idea. It's an interesting concept. It's cute. Um, the tiny sticker... I did change my name color, yeah. Uh, the tiny sticker tail name makes me think it's probably going to be a very small game. Uh, so I do wonder about getting it full price, but we'll see. You know, 